Cabo 2013! Cabo! <laughs> <laughs> mm, that's a surprise for you. But I found. Oh man. Baby, you look hot. Thanks, Faith. <laughs> look at you. I'm so romantic. Got your rose petals. I see that. Wow. What you got there? It's on camera. I want to show you something. Yeah, I want to show you something. Okay. Let's see if I can figure out how to set this up here. Our nation is on the brink of yet another conflict in the Middle East, this time in Syria. The roots of the current upheaval in Syria lie in sectarian divisions, Sunnis versus Alawites. For decades, the nation has been ruled by the Assad family, first Hafez, and now his son Bashar. Their government is made up primarily of members of Syria's Alawite religious minority. They ruled ruthlessly over the country's Sunni Muslim majority using their extensive security and still existent Russian military support to maintain tight control. That is, until two and a half years ago. A loose coalition of Sunni Islamist insurgents rose up against the Assad regime, creating pockets of resistance throughout the country and brought the battle to the nation's capital, Damascus. Most recently, reports came in that a chemical weapons attack by the Assad government killed nearly 1,400 Syrian civilians. This brutal action by the Syrian government on its own citizens crossed President Obama's red line. And now he has asked Congress for the ability to make tactical military strikes in Syria. The American people await their decision. Now, on to Egypt. If you're not having no hair, all you do is take them a little bit more like that and 